Hello, I'm Mick Broomhead with the latest from the Books and Advertiser newsroom. High Peak Councillor Andrew Bingham has been putting his best feet forward for charity. Accompanied by East Midlands MEP Emma McClarkin, Andrew walked the four points of the compass within the High Peak constituency last week to raise money for Buxton and District Summer Club, New Mills Young Women's Group and Glossop Newspapers for the Blind. The 40 mile walk was Andrew's third annual High Peak Hike charity event. It's the third one. We always do it for local charities. We try to get two or three local charities and then share the proceeds. He's, he's raising money for the charities, also raising the awareness of the charities as well. A lot of these charities, you know, they would do some great work, but people in around the towns and the, the high peak probably aren't aware of them. So if they can get a bit of publicity on the back of our walk, uh, which might get them a little bit of extra money or a bit of help, things like that, it's, that's all it's about really. It's just getting to know the community better and getting to know the area better as well. It's an absolutely stunning, stunning countryside here. So it's a fantastic walk I enjoy it every year. Tideswell will be looking blooming marvellous next month as the village holds its first flower festival in six years. The theme of this year's event is the Narnia story, the silver chair and the parish church will be transformed into the magical kingdom for the festival which runs from September the 12th to September the 20th. Local children have recently taken part in craft workshops to make decorations for the festival. The village's last flower festival, which had a jungle book theme, raised around £30,000. The Whaley Bridgeman is preparing for a gruelling 360 mile bike ride for charity. Luke Hill started training for the epic journey from Whaley Bridge to Land's End on September the 13th. Along with pal Jesse Horn from Cornwall, Luke cycling to raise money for dementia charity, the Alzheimer's Society. He has a target of £1,000, so if you'd like to sponsor Luke, then log on to justgiving.com forward slash Luke and Jesse. And in sport, Buxton FC's Unibond Premier League campaign is now well underway. The Bucks drew one all in the opening game against Bradford Park Avenue on Saturday, and the scoreline was repeated on Tuesday night when they travelled to Marine. This weekend, the Bucks face Worksop Town in a Sunday afternoon game, which is to be played at Ilkeston Town's ground with a 3pm kickoff. And finally, New Mills beat Bottisford Town 5-1 in the extra preliminary round of the FA Cup on Saturday before drawing 2 all at Congleton Town on Tuesday night. This weekend, the Millers entertain Bay Cup Borough. And for more amusing other stories, see Thursday's Books and Advertiser.